debris. We often hear what's known as brain drain. That's when somebody is educated locally but takes their talents elsewhere. The opposite of that has happened for a Scranton-born surgeon who was back home to take care of the community that raised him. Eyewitness News Health Beat reporter Mark Killer is here to explain. Mark? Nick, roots run deep for the Scranton Prep and University of Scranton graduate. When it came time to establish his career, he chose his native Lackawanna County, which is quickly becoming a win-win. This is the, the top of your thigh bone, your femur, and that's the ball of the joint. Dr. John Mercury is back where it all started. It's always in the back of my mind about coming back home. The 33-year-old orthopedic surgeon could have written his own ticket to anywhere as a New York City fellowship-trained surgeon in adult reconstruction. Uh, hip and knee replacements are actually the most common surgery uh, in the, the Medicare age population, and the demand for them is increasing. But just like his joint replacement procedures, his Socket. career choice had to be the right the fit, which he says he found at Geisinger Community Medical Center where he'll perform his surgeries. They've made big investments in, in some more advanced robotics and computer uh, technologies, which can really enhance the way that I can take care of patients with arthritis. The pull of northeastern Pennsylvania was also strong because Dr. Mercury knew many patients leave the region to find the specialized care they need. I think some of that care can be provided here, and it would, it's important to me to be able to offer that to the community here. When he said he was coming back, I wasn't surprised, put it that way. Former University of Scranton Athletic Director Toby Lovecchio met Dr. Mercury 15 years ago when Mercury was a U of S student athlete. Lovecchio is pleased the greater Scranton area will reap the benefits of Dr. Mercury's skill set. To make our community stronger, to make our community better, more vibrant, uh, it's just it's just great for Northeastern PA. Dr. Mercury will also pass on his knowledge at Geisinger Commonwealth School of Medicine. I'm going to be helping teaching the medical students in their anatomy course, which is another uh, way that I can be involved uh, in the institution and in the community. Fun fact about Dr. Mercury, he's going to be performing those surgeries at the hospital where he was born. Meantime, he's performed nearly 600 joint replacement procedures.